Hello, it's Hug here. Welcome to Red Dead Redemption 2. We're going to try a slightly different game, similar sort of thing that I've played before. If you enjoy the content, please like and subscribe. We're going to see how it goes. I'm going to have the music on for a change. <laughs> see how much it annoys me. Um, I think I may have already made a character for this, so um, yeah. He's got a ponytail and a beard. Um, I think we'll be a great bit of cutscene. Hello, naturally, no, though. I'm not. I've literally never played this before, so I, I got it yesterday. So I'm going to install it. But I've just installed it. Check the sound out. Check the video settings, and. Um, Yeah. Well, even the West had been mostly been tamed. Poor old horses. It sucks to be a horse in the West. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! I haven't even touched my mouse, mouse sensitivity, so hopefully it'll be okay to default, but I might have to change it. I might actually move the mouse around. Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. See if we can find one of them. This? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. 
but we lost some focus. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't Apart from no we don't have any food. following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey. I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey. You need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. He does like to okay. speak in three word sentences. Let us go. Come on, let's go. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Well, oh, the horse has gone mad. What you doing, horsey? Oh. Why is there no sound coming out of my right ear? Weird. Maybe, maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm having a stroke. Ride next to me, son. Don't want to lose you. Okay. I can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. Let's God. start. I'm not quite sure where we're going. Hey, I think I see something up the path. I might have turned the volume down too much. Sounds a bit too quiet now. Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. It sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davey was a real fighter. Both of them counter boys is, er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac and Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. It looks I'm pretty. Glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Fine. 
Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Look out! Woods! You sure about this, Micah? Mr. Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill. Huddled around a fire waiting for daddy to put food on the table. Said it before, we got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. You think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No, like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Okay, let's head down there. Well, I should have played this at Christmas. It's very Christmassy, isn't it? <laughs> it's like snow. It's Christmas. They're very chatty as well, aren't they? I want to talk. I suddenly realised what I did before. I must have started the multiplayer game. So that's why I had to generate a character. So I'm just playing this guy, I guess. Proves how much I know. Oh, health ain't too good, is it? Well, we have health. Guess we're not healthy. Ooh, it does sound warm. Give uh, my horse a hitching. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. Sounds like quite the party. I've never played a Red Dead game, so... Um... Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. I could get down behind that wagon in front. Arthur, get in position. Come on. It's like, it's like a classic ambush, to be honest. Hello? Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> oh, there's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur, need some there's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Ah, the weapon will. Okay. I'm an excellent shot.
Please make it a run for it. No, no, no. Okay, let's just make sure he's dead. No. Oh, okay, let's get back. Alright, he's dead. Good. Okay. Don't want him getting away. Whiskey. Oh. Looks like the poor bastard was married too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Okie dokie. Throw the firewood. Maybe this. Oat cakes. Oh, Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Oh, I'm starving. You see something now? Get your strength up for the ride back. Open our bag, be a bag, eat a provision. Or well, we're gonna have some biscuits. Nom nom nom. Um uh, I'd like some more biscuits. Place is dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and jack I mean, I do like biscuits. Okay, maybe. Right. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Grab anything you think we can use and meet me out here. Alright, so I've hold down the right mouse button. Health cure. I mean, I don't quite know where they are. But I mean, I'll, I'll take them. Was it upstairs? I oh, should check the upstairs out. Oh, want the ch chest. So, my plan for this let's play, like all my let's plays, is to kind of be as direct as I possibly can when doing the game. So, I'm going to try and like, and I'll take that. Um, try and kind of head fairly directly to the end because I'm aware in these games that you know you can get a little sidetracked. So, I'm going to try and not get sidetracked because. Uh, I want to try and actually complete it one day and uh, understand that this game is is fairly large so I don't necessarily want to be playing it for the rest of my life it's probably the, the best way to put it I'm not saying I'm I mean you know I've just come out of finishing Just Cause 2 yeah, or Just Cause 2, Just Cause 4 and um, why am I crouching? oh blood blood Oh, okay. All right, I think. Is there any more stuff? What's taking so long in there? I'm not very good at searching for things. Oh. Um. Still looking, Dutch. I I feel like I have conducted a thorough search of this place. 
Uh, and it's boring. So, let's get out of here. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we miss. Sure. Get a knife out to do that. See, told you I need my knife. Give the old effing of his life. <laughs> Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Oh, hello. A uh, question. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What Eight. are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. Well, never leave a man to take revenge. That's kind of got to be my motto. All right, horsey, chill out. I got de-hatted. Ah, so weird. Why do I have to push tab to pick up my gun and R to pick up my hat? So strange. Fair enough. Hello. Hello. Uh, calm. I've bonded with the horse level one. That's a decent horse. I shall call him. Okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. 
It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. She gonna be a bit cold. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He. He was my husband. Somebody's coming. Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently, scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. A bunch of biscuits. This poor soul, Mrs. Adler. Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's going to be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. It's so white. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I'm sorry, I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. He'd look for me. I would look for you. Thank wherever you. you are. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. It's very snowy in this game, isn't it? Bad for pointing how badly I haven't cleared my screen. <laughs> Go back to dark again. I don't want to look at the filth on my screen. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Right, let's go. To the river. Yep, that's good. Come on, let's go. Across. See, they continue up that way. 
I don't know, this isn't good for the horse. I would like to walk through bloody water. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Well, I feel sorry for my horse. Take Poor thing. Throat. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Tracks go left, down here. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Alright, so we've got a bit of a weird camera that just automatically follows. Huh, strange. Careful, it's getting narrow here. Don't worry, I'll use my grapple gun if I fall. Oh, wait a minute, wrong game. Come on, boy. Horse struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. This, Javier, we, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there. Come on, then. Hey, look. Over there. You see that? I would not be happy as a horse walking through this environment. I know horses don't like not being able to see where they've put their feet. Let's see if he can hear us. Sounds like a silly idea in the mountain range. Also, don't show the horses, dead horse. Sorry. What? Hold on. <laughs> that gun, then? Shut up. Hold tab to view store weapons, yeah? Use. Is it like, all right, I got it. All right, okay, I only get one main gun. All right, Come sorry, on. horse. <laughs> Didn't realize horses were like weapon stores of the, uh, of the game. <laughs>
Watch out here. Oh, you don't eat. I was going to walk where you walk, so I wouldn't have to do that much walking. You're telling me. I'm not sure why I'm using a shotgun. Whatever. Careful. There's a drop here. Careful here. Why are you being so careful? This is the walking tutorial. Watch your head here. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Come on. Sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Oh, it's like dying light all over again. Gonna do a bit of parkour. How you doing? I'm miserable. Been a tough few days. I know. Here, take a drink of this. Thanks. Stamina beverage. Not designed for the snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? Most. John, where are you? Marston, you hear me? Up here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! He's down here! Down here! Alright! Hot down, Marston! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but... Good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. It's good to see that I get to carry him. Can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Got my trusty shotgun, though. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. We're getting you out of here. <laughs> Draw them off us, Arthur. Ooh. Bring them this way. Stay there. Hey. I feel mean. Well done, Arthur. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. Come on then, let's go before more wolves show up. Come on then, let's get back to the others. Yeah. 
I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. <sighs> you knew a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Oh dear, already see. Four coming down the hill. Get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Four coming in on the left. Get the hell out of here. Get out. So, Jesus, you still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter. For now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Nah, you can do better than that. One thing you ain't short on is fantasy. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Hey, we made it home. John! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Right, here we go. There we go. <gasps> Ay, careful, <gasps> idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're going to get out of this. I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that... that civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Moggy. <sighs> We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait to thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? Right. I think that's enough for now. Well, it seems to be potentially okay. Carriage's a bit chatty, never played it before. Shot a few wolves, rode around a bit. Climbed out some stuff. Awesome. Okay, well, we shall do some more of this next time. If you've enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications. That'd be most awesome. Okay, I shall see you next time. Bye.